Hey guys, welcome back to Vita's Garage. Today I'm going to show you how I wired my keyless entry system on my Mercedes 190E. And this procedure, this is actually a universal kit. And this procedure will work on a lot of cars and classic Mercedes, and you can do it on classic BMWs and other cars. Uh, you just have to look at the wiring diagram and just kind of go through it. Uh, but yeah, um, I'm about to show you what I did and how I did it and hopefully this will help you out as well okay guys so we're gonna go over this really quick with you and here's the cover i'm gonna take it off and show you how it looks it's not it's not ready yet because i have to treat some of this stuff all right but here's the pump i'm gonna peel this back carefully and this is how it all looks okay it looks like spaghetti all right but i'll go over this with you guys and explain to you how stuff is supposed to be and work okay but first let's go over this diagram that i drew okay so you do have keyless module okay this is the box by the way damn it Okay guys, so let's go over this really quick. So this is the box. It's just a universal uh, keyless entry uh, that I got. And now, yeah, I drew everything right now. So this is the keyless module right here, okay? Which is this guy right here, okay? That's the keyless module, it has a bunch of wires coming to it, okay? Now, the main wires you have to worry about is uh, the ones that go to your central locking system, all right? so orange white yellow um you know black orange black white black yellow black and red okay this is how i wired this in in order for it to work all right so we have this orange wire okay this orange wire is going to go across and it's going to connect to white and black wire so white and black wire will connect together with the orange wire Okay, they're going to be spliced together. Now, the white wire, along with the orange and black wire, will go over here. Okay, so once again, white with orange and black, they're going to come together here, and you're going to splice them into this green wire. Okay, and this green wire goes to your vacuum pump. Okay, let me show you that really quick. All right, so, so this is your keyless module and then these wires right here from here back i just taped them because i don't need them those wires are actually for like your horn and and your lights and stuff like that so i decided as of right now i'm not gonna, not gonna touch those so anyways so let's go back to this white and white and black wires or i'm sorry white and orange black wires okay so we have a white right over here and orange and black and they are spliced together into this green wire okay right over here and this one goes to your vacuum pump this harness right here goes to your vacuum pump okay so that's one okay now the power next one is uh, we're gonna go to the ground okay so we're gonna go to yellow wire and black wire okay yellow and black wire they're spliced together to a ground and where are you gonna find the ground okay the ground so the vacuum pump gets power and ground so you're gonna come to this wire and right here as you see brown wire right there okay this brown wire that's your ground so you're gonna take your black wire and yellow wire from the keyless module and you're gonna connect it, connect them both to your ground wire right here, to your brown wire. So that's one. Then you're gonna, you also need the power. So the power is gonna be yellow, black wire and red. That's your 12 volt power. So you're gonna connect those okay which is right here that's where they are okay it's your red and yellow with black 
they're connected to this red and white wire which is your 12 volts constant okay and that's pretty much it uh it's pretty simple right now what my main goal is i need to make sure that if i see any copper that i touch it up with uh liquid electrical tape and all that stuff and make sure i preserve everything and also this uh power wire has a, a fuse which is nice you know uh, right here this red power wire has a fuse so yeah anyways i'm gonna let you look at this again okay and then this is your what i was saying at the beginning this is your orange wire and your white wire white with the black stripe and orange they connect together they're from this module okay. so and then once again the only two wires that connect to this green wire are the orange and black and white and they also come from this module all right so i'll let you look at this again okay make sure you do uh pause it and look at this so you can use that for your own purposes so you're gonna get two remotes with this key um and yeah the ones that you're gonna be using is just this unlock unlock all right i'll show it to you later and how it works and one more thing is as i was saying there are a couple of wires okay that you can use one of them was for the horn and the other one that you can wire in is for your turn signals so when you open and close it that your turn signals will flash which i would really love to add but i don't know if i'm going to i just don't like adding a bunch of aftermarket bs you know so yeah i'm not sure if i'm gonna do that just yet but uh, and then another one is for your horn and then uh, there's another one which is pretty cool that you can add it just connects to the module is this led so it's when every time when you lock your car this one will be flashing so yeah i really really hope this helps you know i tried uh, i really tried my best to explain this situation but anyways as soon as i'm done with this and uh, putting everything nicely away i will actually get back to you Okay, so this is what I did with these wires. I just covered them with liquid electrical tape right there. Just to avoid any possibility of future corrosion. So there you go. I'm just gonna let it dry a little longer and can reinstall everything back. All right, here's the final product after the liquid electrical tape uh, got dry. You know, I wrapped everything nicely in this tape. Okay, uh, this nice tape same thing i did with this one nice and now i'm gonna nicely pack it in there and reinstall everything so i'm just uh taping the rest of this wiring harness and i zip tied a few things here just to make it nicer so it doesn't look like a lot of spaghetti everywhere but uh yeah i take electrical system very seriously so i'm gonna keep wrapping this up and then i'll install this cover back all right guys that's the final product that's how this baby is gonna sit in here tucked in mm, module is gonna be there and i'm gonna close this up Amazing.